If you want to grow seeds from your own bat flower plant seed pods, you must wait until the seeds inside the pods mature, and this can take quite a long time. How long? I decided to find out. I tracked three seed pod stems, taking monthly photos until the pods ripened. Let's check them out. It's November 18th, and this seed pod has been drying for four months now. This seed pod is totally dry and all shriveled up, and it is very kind of soft to the touch, and it is ready to be harvested. This is unusually quick for a seed pod to be ready to harvest. I think some of the factors might be the fact that the lip on this pot was broken and so it's rather sharp. There are only two seed pods and they're not real large. The flower stem is totally dry and desiccated. You can see how incredibly thin and dried out the stem is. And I'm going to open it up and show you the seeds. You can see all these nice black seeds and this is the color that you want. These are nice mature seeds and they should be easy to grow, easy to germinate, especially while they are fresh. I started this second batch when the flower was just open and the seed pods were just forming. Here they are after one month. And here they are after two months. And now three months. And after four months, you can see they're starting to get quite shriveled and dried, though still a bit green. Disaster has struck. It is now almost five months, and these seed pods got wet from a late season rain and immediately turned moldy. Extremely frustrating. But the flower stem was already dried and shriveled up, as are the seed pods. I believe the seeds inside can be removed as usual and are still viable. I managed to tag this flower stem as soon as it started. Here it is after one month. And now after two months. And here it is after three months. And here, after four months, you can see that they are starting to turn black and shrivel up. This group also got wet and turn moldy after almost five months of growth. The flower stem is dried and shriveled up and so are the seed pods, so I'm pretty sure the seeds inside are still viable. Though I experienced some unexpected problems with mold, I think the results are still valid and give you a good general idea of what you can expect. So to answer the question posed in my thumbnail, it was my experience that it takes from four to five months for these seeds to mature. And to that, let me quickly add these disclaimers. This video is intended as a general guide. I used only black bat flower plants, Taka Chantieri, and the seed pods from other varieties may take different lengths of time. And of course, seed pods may dry more quickly or slowly, depending on your particular climatic and growing environment. I'm sure there are lots of variation, and in the comments below, I would love to hear from others who have documented how long it took their seeds to develop. Be sure and check out my original How to Grow Bat Flower Plant Seeds from the link in the description below. Please support my channel by leaving a like and subscribing. Take care and happy gardening everyone. Click on the playlist tab for videos grouped by subject. See ya!